Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Sensor. There was a video here today. It was a brand new video giving you guys some really awesome text effects to use for your thumbnails. I did a video like this before, but these thumbnails, or excuse me, text effects, literally like, like it's 10 million times better than the first one that I did. And I just want you guys to know it and understand it and enjoy it because these are really freaking dope. Like there's a base yellow one, a red one, and then like a nice simple white base one, which is basically all the stuff you basically see throughout your the kind of like YouTube meta right now. So hopefully you guys will enjoy these. For the record, they'll be in the description down below for you guys to also download as well. Um, because you don't have to watch the video technically in a way, but I kind of went through the reasons of why I chose the layer styles I did. And I just kind of like give you guys all the names and stuff like that, or the numbers and stuff like that as well. So if you guys wanna watch, you can, but also realistically just check the description down below and get them as well. But uh, yeah, that's what I got. So enjoy the video. Also, really quick, I wanted to add a selfie.com slash Cisco HQ. If you guys have not already purchased the everything pack for $30, which basically you get everything on my selfie.com store. Uh, literally anything that's on the store at all and also exclusive stuff that I have of course have not come out But also anything that comes out on my cell phone you get for free no matter the price So it's kind of like this one buy all it's also completely Undervalued and I always get told I try to raise the price all that stuff or whatever I love you guys if you guys do enjoy it and purchase it all that good stuff And I think around like 3700 people have bought it so far So if you're not the only one you hopefully you'll enjoy it and uh, find all the really cool stuff for it too So that's all I got now you can do the video and uh, let's get into the first layer style all right guys, so to achieve this awesome yellow text effect, your layer style should go as followed. First is bevel and emboss. Depth at 460, size at 40 points, soften at four, negative 86 angle, and 53 altitude. Then near the bottom, highlight at 0% opacity, while the shadow mode is on multiply on black with 2% opacity. Then we have inner shadow with the color FFFFBD0 at four distance, zero choke, and zero size. This will help with getting the highlight at the top of the text. After that is inner glow with linear dodge blend mode with 85% opacity, color hex code being 412E0F, choke at 0%, size at 90, and this will basically help the text have an amazing glow within the middle and also really isn't achievable any other way. Next is a very simple gradient that goes from the orange EBB22A, and in the middle is F8DA35, then at the end is the same color as the first one. Outer Glow is next with Linear Dodge Add at 50% opacity with the hex code D5951A as your color, 11 spread, and then 250 size. Then lastly is two drop shadows, the first one being at 13% opacity on the color black, zero distance, zero spread, and size at 133. Then for the last drop shadow is the color 3B120F with 100% opacity, 18 distance, 100 spread, and 14 size. And this will basically help your text effect go from a nice 2D look to a nice fun 3D playful look. This text effect will honestly stand out wherever you guys end up putting it, and I think you guys will really love it. Let's move on to the next one. Next up is a perfect red style text effect that is sure to get attention. Starting off with your stroke, size is at 25, opacity at 75, and your scale is at 123. Then moving into inner shadow for highlights, hex code FF9393, five distance, zero choke, zero size. Then another inner shadow, which will help it make it feel 3D without using a drop shadow. Now with the hex code 5C0909, 21 distance and zero choke in size, you should see that the text turns 3D really quickly. Next is sand on blend mode multiply. Color is black, 6% opacity and 47 distance. Then a gradient overlay for the color with three anchors once again, starting with the first one being EB2A2A, middle one being FF1E1E, and then of course the last node being the same one as the first. Naturally, we gotta add two more drop shadows as well to house the 3D text in that we just made with the inner shadow. The first drop shadow with a pure white, zero distance, 100 spread, and 31 size. Then the last drop shadow will have a gray with 707070 hex code, 31 distance, 100 spread, and 28 size. Then to top it all off, a bevel and emboss to give the drop shadow a fun effect. 630 depth, 40 size, five soften, and then angle at 60, and altitude at 15 degrees. At the bottom, screen should be at white at 50% opacity, and then the multiply on black at 15% opacity. If you need attention to any word, this effect will honestly do it right for you. And for the last text effect in this video, it's a fun play on the generic white style effect that you would see that is pretty much great for everything. This is actually starting off with three inner shadows. I know, it's quite a lot. But the first one is on pure white, 100% opacity, five distance, zero choke, and zero size, while angle is at 90 degrees. Then on the second one is the exact same thing, however, your degrees is at negative 100 and six distance. Then for the last inner shadow is 82% opacity, six distance, zero choke, and zero size. For the color, we're gonna be using a gradient once again, so three anchors. The first one's on pure white. Second one is E1E1E1 E1, E1 hex code. And third one is C1C1C1 C1, C1 hex code. These colors all look great together to kind of help create a nice subtle gradient that is sure to look less boring. Next, however, is Outer Glow, which honestly sounds useless, but it actually isn't. 
it gives the text a nice little subtle glow that honestly does not look too great without it and all you guys have to do is have linear dodge add 26 percent opacity 11 spread and 250 size and then lastly are three drop shadows. The first one is hex code 777777, 80% opacity, one distance, 100 spread, and four size. Second drop shadow is 999999, 19 distance, 100 spread, and four size. And then the last one is pure black, 100% opacity, 15 distance, 100 spread, and 36 size. And there you guys all go. This effect will basically help your text look way less boring, very simple and catchy. And honestly, it's just a nice generic thing to have in your back pocket. All right, guys, so that's the end of the video here today. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you guys have some nice, clean, freaking dope text effects to use on your thumbnails. And I'm sure you're going to see them around. I basically see all the ones I did last episode around the YouTube literally forever. So I'm sure this is going to be the same kind of thing. It's going to catch meta. It's going to be like a really cool thing. Nice to be the first ones to use it. If you guys are watching this video under 10,000 views, you guys are winning. So just go ahead and use it. Enjoy it. All that good stuff. But that is it for me today. Sensible HQ out. Do not forget to keep smiling, stay positive, and stay a freaking product, guys. Later. Love you guys. And uh, enjoy the video. Enjoy the week. Excuse me, enjoy the weekend. That there you go. I'm gonna I'm gonna end the video. Later. Love you.